The Japanese government says it will spend nearly half a billion dollars to build a so-called frozen wall around the Fukushima nuclear plant. More radioactive water is leaking from the facility, which was crippled by the 2011 earthquake and tsunami. Water has been pumped in to cool the reactors, but storing the radioactive water is proving difficult for the plant's operator. Now, that disaster took its toll on Japan's tourism industry, with visitor numbers plummeting in the months after the tsunami and earthquake. But the industry has bounced back since then, thanks to Japan's world-class cuisine. Terence Terashima reports. Helped by the depreciated yen, Japan has seen a considerable increase in tourists visiting the country. Japan National Tourist Organization report said visitors increased by nearly 5 million, or 22.8 percent, in the first six months of this year. And the same poll by the JNTO said nearly 60 percent were looking forward to enjoy Japanese food during their stay. Chefs here take a lot of, a lot of care in preparing the food, and they actually they want you to enjoy it. And the chefs are eager to live up the expectations. Many of the Japanese hotels and inns pride themselves on the meals they can offer, and some of them got together to compete who can offer the best breakfast. The finalists are selected from over 800 hotels and inns around Japan, and the top chefs had few ideas up their sleeves. If you cook tofu with water from hot spring, you will get a unique texture. I would like to make a vegetable dish with that. It will be something special. Every vegetables or fish have best seasons to eat. Japanese meals are very much about seasons. I would like the guests to feel the seasons in my dish. And the dishes are very carefully prepared. Textures and flavors are calculated to get best combination in your mouth. The presentations are art-like. Colorful dishes with matching cups and plates decorate the table. Almost too beautiful to eat. The chefs say it's nothing special. Presentation is a key element to Japanese cuisine, and breakfast is considered an important meal of the day. By featuring those like the breakfast as the main theme, I just we just are trying to uh, like to add additional reasons for the tourist to pick up the right hotel or right places to visit. The chef said this kind of contest helps improve their skills and exchange ideas. They hope that more foreign customers would come and try these breakfasts to start their day. Terence Terashima, CCTV, Tokyo.